Traditional screening involves a clinician-collected cervical sample for a PAP or HPV test. Mayo Clinic's Dr. Kathy McLaughlin says a new option will hopefully get more people screened. We're calling it HPV self-collection test. So the difference is that instead of your clinician putting in a speculum and doing a swab of the cervix, you would use a self-collection device, you the patient, and do a vaginal swab. So it's essentially a primary HPV screening test. She says the test is quick and painless. It's aimed at people facing barriers to having a speculum exam. For example, those with disabilities, mobility issues, cultural or religious reasons, or a history of trauma. The test is done privately in a healthcare setting, such as an exam room. A device is inserted just like a tampon into the vagina, and these nice little plastic wings control the insertion depth so people don't have to worry about pushing it in too far. And then they would take the plunger and push that in, and that extends the sampling brush. So this is a very soft, dry bristle brush, and then the handle needs to be rotated five times, and it clicks, you can hear the click, you can feel the click, so you know you've done enough turns. Once that has been done, the patient would remove the entire device and just retract the brush and cap it, and this will get sent to the lab for the testing. Talk with your healthcare team to determine which test is best for you. Most important, says Dr. McLaughlin, is to get screened. The beauty of screening is that we're catching things before it's cancer when it's still treatable as a precancer. For the Mayo Clinic News Network, I'm Marty Velasco-Hames.